Hey YouTubers, Shy Cubs fan 14 or John here, bringing you a review of my Blue Yeti microphone. I've been using it for a while now and I thought I would do a review. So here we go. Like we talked about, it's a pretty solid piece of equipment. The only thing that came in the box were the microphone, the USB cable, and the instruction book, which is over here on the left hand side. And as you can see, it's not a very thick instruction book. If I turn it here on the side, you'll notice that it's rather thin. It's written in several languages, but it does its uh, job. Like I told you before, I bought the microphone for the fact that it was a plug and play microphone and was Mac and PC capable or compatible. So that's why I bought it. It's a nice solid piece of equipment. And if you look at it here, on the left hand side are the knobs that adjust it so that you can move it forwards or backwards, tighten them to make sure that it's secure. In the front is the blue insignia. Below that is the mute button. So you can turn that on or off. If you wanna stop recording, hit the mute button and it won't record anything any further. It's a nice feature. Below that is the microphone uh, volume button for your earphones and what that does is is you can plug earphones in the bottom right here next to the USB cable and put a pair of headphones in and you can listen while you're recording it's a very nice piece of equipment like I said solidly constructed it's made out of um, heavy material it's about three pounds probably stands a good 12 inches tall so I'm really pleased with it if you take a closer look here, you can see the insignia, the mute button, and the volume button. So I'm pretty happy with that. Um, if you lean it forward here and show you the bottom of the microphone, obviously on the left-hand side, you can see where the USB cable plugs into the microphone. Super simple. You just uh, plug it in and, and uh, you're ready to go. So uh, when you want to get move it, you just pull it out to take it out, and then you plug it back in. The other end goes into the computer. Over here on the other side is the jack, like I was talking about, where you can put your headphones in. And that allows you to put out any noises while you're recording if you want to, and you can listen to what you're recording. So a little closer look here, you can see those. Um, it's a nice microphone. If we move it up and, and lean it back forward, you can see that... It moves. Um, I'm going to spin it around here to the back once again. Got nice weight to it. On the back are where there are two more controls. Uh, the top control is the gain button, which assists you with the decibel ratings. Below that are the four preset buttons. And those four presets work for things that are like podcast, interviews, musicals, those types of things. So you have the presets, they have little signs there. You can set it up the way that you want for what you want to do. So if we move it back around to the front, once again, you can see that it's pretty solid. I'm completely pleased with this uh, piece of equipment. It costs about $92. I think the audio quality is outstanding. Once again, it's Mac and PC compatible. It is truly a plug and play. The instruction book tells you exactly how to work it and there's no qualms about it so i'm really pleased with this yeti um, i think that if you're looking to get an upgrade this is the way to go if you like the video please leave a like if you have any comments please let me know how things are going with my videos and if you're crazy subscribe